cut those supply lines while he isn't expecting it. Davis is with the Empire now. Wouldn't they keep him supplied? The Sith Empire welcomes our defectors, but they're not going to equip men whose loyalty isn't proven. Tavis will need other sources. In the past, when Havoc needed supplies outside of the normal Republic channels, they purchased the items from underworld groups here on Coruscant. I have units working to cut off these underworld sources, but two organizations are proving difficult. The Black Sun and the Migrant Merchants Guild. I'll take care of these people for you, sir. You'll begin with the Migrant Merchants Guild. Our intelligence indicates that they're supplying Tavis with a full platoon of advanced war droids. Your mission, in the broad strokes, will be to locate the droid shipments going to Tavis and destroy them. What if we let the shipments go? Then we could follow them straight to Tavis. I can't risk the possibility that these items could fall into Tavis's hands. One of my people, Corporal Garum, will meet you outside the Migrant Merchant Guild's territory with the full operational details. These missions are critical, Lieutenant. Our future success or failure is contingent on how well supplied Tavis and his followers are. I won't fail. Good. The safety of the entire Republic depends on your success. I'll be observing your operations from here through your armor cam. Good luck, Lieutenant. Dismissed. Lieutenant, Corporal Garum, sir. Ready to brief you on the Migrant Merchants Guild at your command, sir. Let's get down to business. Here's the situation, sir. The Migrant Merchants Guild is a criminal organization comprised primarily of non-humans whose homes were destroyed by the Empire's assault on Coruscant. They began squatting in this district and refused to leave when Republic security tried to push them out. There's been an uneasy truce ever since. What's the op? General Garza informed me that your primary target within the Guild is a cyborg inventor named Krell. Reports indicate that Krell's strength and speed are at least triple the human norm, with genius-level intelligence to boot. Taking him down will be a real challenge, sir. I can handle myself. With all due respect, sir, you shouldn't underestimate him. By all accounts, Krell is an extremely dangerous fighter. Additionally, Krell has designed and constructed a full platoon of advanced war droids that we believe are intended for Tavis and the other Spec Force traders. A full platoon is a lot of firepower to lose. Tavis is really gonna feel this one. General Garza wants all of Krell's war droids neutralized before they can be shipped out, sir. What's so advanced about these war droids? Heavy armor, multiple integrated weapon systems, and advanced combat and targeting logic, sir. The deadliest droids money can buy. Krell has his war droids patrolling the Migrant Merchants Guild base. General Garza wants them all found and destroyed. Do you have a fix on Krell's location? Negative, sir. We know he's inside, but that's about it. That concludes the briefing, sir. Good luck and good hunting.
public scum. Do you really believe you can come here and destroy my creations without conscience? When you die here today, your feeble republic will learn what it means to meddle in my work. Have you been practicing that line? You're a brave fool, aren't you? But bravery cannot save you. You're far too late. My plans are already in motion. Soon the people of this world will be brought to their knees by my greatest creations, by masterpieces. I won't let that happen. This is no idle threat. The droids you destroyed were mere playthings compared to what I have now created. I have taken ordinary humans off the streets and implanted several of them with advanced cybernetic enhancements. Their abilities now rival even my own. The cyborg's enhancements are internal and undetectable. The subjects themselves don't know who among them was augmented, and neither will anyone else until it's much too late. I'm gonna make you pay for hurting those people, Krell. Fool! This cannot end in any way but your death. After you've been dealt with, I'll release my creations back to their normal lives to wait until my hidden programming activates. This guy's full of it. I don't buy any of this. Once my masterpieces begin their work, the people of Coruscant will never be safe again. What are these cyborgs going to do? I'm afraid you're never going to find out. Destroy him! Come in, Lieutenant. I want you to move immediately and destroy the cyborgs that Krell created. We need to deal with them now before they can disappear into the normal population. These situations are never easy. These people did not choose to be what they now are, but many more lives could be at stake. You have to eliminate Krell's creations. We can't know for sure if Krell was telling the truth, sir. Whether Krell was bluffing or not, these cyborgs are a risk we cannot allow. I'm giving you the kill order, Lieutenant. I take full responsibility for the consequences. Now get it done. Killing these people is wrong and you know it, Garza. It's right for the Republic. That's our only concern. Garza out. This is a waste of time. We should be going after the traitors. Not gunning people down just because some madman said they're dangerous. I'm not going to murder these people. I don't care what Garza says. Whatever we're gonna do, let's do it fast. Stay back. The door's locked and sealed. You can't get in. We heard all of the fighting, and we heard you talking to that freak, Krell. We're not coming out until you swear you won't hurt us. Just open the door. Let's talk about this. But we're not cyborgs. I, I know if I was some half-machine freak. This is insane. You out there. Listen, I'm not sure about these others, but I can assure you that I'm not a cyborg. What? Are you calling me a freak like Krell? I am not a freak. Maybe you're the cyborg and you're trying to trick everyone. I am not! He spent far more time operating on you than he did on me, so if anyone's- Both of you, stop it! None of us are cyborgs. That's all there is to it. There's just no way to tell for sure, ma'am. This is insane! Even if a few of us are cyborgs, would you really murder all of us just to be sure none of the cyborgs escape? You're right. This is absurd. I can't do this. Then. You won't hurt us. You'll let us go. Give me your names and identification numbers, and I'll let you go. What? So you can track us all down and kill us later? No way. If it gets us out of here alive, then it's worth it. We'll put the information on a data pad for you, soldier. Okay. Stand back. I'm going to open the door.
Here's the data pad, soldier. Thank you for sparing us. Let's go home, everyone. Stay safe out there. Thanks again, soldier. Farewell. Lieutenant, my orders were perfectly clear. Eliminate Krell's cyborgs. With all due respect, General, I could not obey those orders. My orders are not polite suggestions, Lieutenant. You don't choose to follow them. You follow them. Lieutenant, when you are on a mission, you listen to my orders. Then your brain, then your heart, in that order. There's no room for sentiment in our line of work. There should be similarly little room for it in you, or we're doomed to fail. If we're heartless, what separates us from the Empire? We are heartless so that the people of the Republic don't have to be, Lieutenant. So that the Republic does not become the Empire. Always remember that. Return to my office now. We need to discuss your next assignment. Garza out. Ah, Lieutenant. I trust no more needs to be said about your work against the Migrant Merchants Guild. Let's move on to your next target, the Black Sun, a powerful organization composed of Coruscant's most violent criminals. Black Sun has a wide network of sources providing them with the deadliest weaponry available, including a powerful nerve agent that they're selling to Tavis in bulk. Just what is this stuff capable of? I don't have the exact specifications on hand, but it's among the most deadly nerve gases in existence. You'll need to be cautious. A Spec 4 Sergeant Jaxo has carried out some advanced reconnaissance of Black Sun's headquarters. You'll rendezvous with her for a detailed plan of attack. We can't risk any of this nerve gas falling into Tavis's hands, Lieutenant. Use all necessary force. Dismissed. Wow, you're the new Havoc CEO. Must be my lucky day. I'm Jaxo. It's a real pleasure to meet you. Working with a beautiful woman on a dangerous mission? I'd say it's my lucky day. You wanna focus, sir? We've got a job to do here, remember? Nothing says your boss can't have a little fun, Sergeant. Let's get those op details out of the way. Your highly enviable task is to destroy a cache of nerve gas canisters that the Black Sun Syndicate is shipping to Tavis. The gas is called Travoris. Scary stuff. One canister can cover a square kilometer, with 100% fatality inside of 10 minutes. Do we have any way to safely deal with this stuff? Lucky for us, it's pretty easy to neutralize Travoris, at least while it's still in the canisters. The compound in this bottle renders Travoris completely inert on contact. Just plug it into the canisters inside the Black Sun base, and the whole batch is history. Should I just leave the neutralized gas behind? Once the Travoris is neutralized, it's useless. No need to retrieve it. General Garza said not to bother. You also have another objective. A few hours ago, a bright red case was moved into the Black Sun's base under heavy...